I still can't believe you went. What are you thinking? Going to that place. Wish you hadn't got yourself into this mess, but you did. You can't run forever. I know you were just trying to do right by me, so I need you to do what's right by us. Now, please, Cass. I am so tired of fighting. I just want it to be over. I want you home. The girls want you home, but... If you don't deal with this, then we are done for good. I love you. But I won't wait forever. Jesus. Jesus, Jesus. Girls need your Christmas card. <laughs> Merry fucking Christmas. Kaz, Roy's finishing up breakfast if you want something. Uh, I'll, I'll be there in a minute, Trots. Aye, well, didn't wait too long or someone will be off with you. Aye, yeah, all right. doing up there? Pipes leaking. If it's not one thing, it's the other. See this old rig? It's a pile of shite. It's falling apart. And we've only just started drilling. Fucking Cadal. And fucking Rennick cutting corners. Aye. Speaking of, you are in the shite, wee man. Rennick got a letter this morning from the mainland and he's been up to high dough ever since. Heard he's gunning for you. That's just brilliant. Christ, I need a smoke. Can't find my lighter anywhere. Take mine. I don't need it anymore, honestly. You're a fucking lifesaver. I'm going to get breakfast. All right. I'll see you for darts tonight. We'll put a wee picture of Rennick up on the board for you. <laughs> Sounds like a plan. See you. Casmel Mocker. I do. McClary! To my office. That means now, not as soon as you're ready. Now! Ah, the sweet sound of Davy Rennick. You think it's the Paulus? Can't be surprised, Cas. We hear from Suze. She's talking about divorce. Oh, I'm sorry, Cas. She'll come around. Not if I get the jail, she won't. Well, maybe you could have considered that while you were battering Billy Chamberlain's head in. Cunt slagged off, Susie. Had it coming. And there he is. Floats like a butterfly, stings like a bee, and swears like the devil himself. Listen, mate, even if it is the police, maybe it's best to just go back and face it, yeah? Ugh, I don't know, Roy. I'm fucking scun up with the whole thing. The Lord loves you, mate, no matter what. And I'm pretty sure Suze does too. That's all clear for you now, Roy. Lovely job, thanks, Dobby. Oh, Trot says he's left your insulin in your cabin. Oh, bless his little communist socks. Muchly appreciated. Ta. Remember, life is like football. It's not over until the final whistle. Aye. You're a Barnsley fan, so you're pretty much fucked from the off, right? Oh, I will see you hand for that McCleary. Not off you trot, lad, before his nibs blows a gasket. with some leftovers.
up and see what the score is. I can scale Venice here all by myself. <laughs> no, we're all right. Cheers, though. Fair enough. You want to transfer here, McCleary? You'd give me less lip. No. He loves it. McCleary! My office. I don't make me ask again. In a better mood today, is he? We'll be all right, guys. You get used to it. We all get a turn. Try not to punch him. <laughs> no promises. Give me a minute to check. This one's all yours. All right, Roper, what's the problem? Don't usually see you down here. Ah, the drill's acting up this morning. Got the crew running around like blue-ass flies, but they cannot make head or tail of it. Is that you behind schedule, then? Oh, not yet. Uh, not if the gods are smiling on us. So mere fuck than ever. Who as fucked as you, by the sounds of it? Look, you better get up there. The boss man sounds raging. Say a prayer and all. Stay on the path, mate. The cargo ice will crush you if you get close. Clean it! Jesus, Scooby. Give me a heart attack. Oh, sorry, mate. Can I ask a wee favour? What do you need, Scoop? Oh, could you do me a quick fix on the crew lift fuse box while you're down there? Aye, no bother. Oh, you're a lifesaver, mate. And don't let the big man get you down, all right? Thanks, pal. Glad you could join me, and sorry to have got you out of bed. Shut the door and have a seat. Oh, I'm fine, standing. Sit your ass in that chair, you fucking liability. But I don't... I am on a tight ship. 
Do you understand me? A tight ship. Technically, it's no ship. Shut your gub, you nag prick! I am sick, sick to fucking bunk on you wee gub sites messing with my operation. That chef might be a mate of yours, but he does not run things around here. I do. Do you understand me? All right, why don't you just get on with it? Don't you answer me back! You might be the height of shite on shore, McClary, but out here, I am the fucking king. Do you understand me? You bring the polis to my door, to my rig. Uh, I, I can sort this, right? I just need time. Shut it, you clatty gobshite. I've got here some mama who can make a more positive contribution to this operation than you. But I know Shut it! I'm in a meeting. What? Fuck's sake, Gibbo, I don't care. We're on a schedule. It's a fucking drill. You've got a fucking drill, so drill through it. Yeah, well, Roper's a whiny old fud. He's got a problem with everything. I don't care if it feels off. Just fucking do it! Or I'll come down there myself! Is that uh, trouble with the missus? You're fired. You hear me? Fired. Uh, come on, man. I, it's only a wee bit of trouble with the polis. I'm good with the lecky. I keep things running. You said it yourself. Ouch! Get off my rig! Aye. Happy New Year to you too, you cunt. And for you guys. Two bars and a ball bag. Now listen, Pat. I promise I'll take care of him. I had a word with our Kieran. You remember him? He knows Billy Chamberlain from way back. He owes me a favour. Reckons he can sweeten Billy up a bit. Come on. Have I ever let you down? No, you lost the cake at the wedding. No, now then, now then. That, that wasn't my fault. You left it on a bench at Argyle Street. Aye, you were that bloated you didn't even remember baking the cunt. My children, that was before the light of the Lord came to me. Here we fucking go. Yeah. And you, Mr. McCleary, you can fuss and cuss all you like. But perhaps if you went to the Saracens a little less and the Tabernacle a little more, then perhaps you'd not be in this pickle, hey? Don't, don't look at me. You're the one who decided to spend the next four months trapped on a rig with this bad pot. Susan, I promise you, I promise you, we will get this straightened out. I will. You'd better. I need your help here! 
killing me, but... Aye, aye, I think so. You got me out. Did you get Gregor? I got you, aye. I couldn't find Gregor. Fuck. I'm sorry, Cass. Jesus. He's not the only one we lost. Oh, no, no. Rass is still in there. Why aren't these working? Kaz, I need you to help me. Kaz! What? Right, aye, what, what do you need? The cable's stuck. Go down and release the main brake, then come back up and raise the bell. If you can get it to my level, I think I can get him out. Aye. Raffs, it's all right, we're getting you out. We'll be two minutes, pal. explosion nobody knows but whatever it was it was big you were lucky trust me Douglas is trying to find out Mayor like if the bear is even safe now what's wrong with rafts I don't know all right decompression shouldn't be this bad oh, I shouldn't have let him go down there I said I'd look after him I'm here rafts it's pro day I'm gonna get you out is there anything there I can do? No, I'll get him. We need to know what's going on up top. You need to go through engineering. The way up is blocked from here. Where's engineering for here? I've never been doing this end before. The only way you'll get there is to go under the rig. Should be a clearer path down there. All right, I'll head down now. <laughs>
Oh, fucking hell. Shit! Oh, fucking hell. Just get across. Useful. Seen a ghost? 
Who's making that noise? Gibble. He's making that racket. We should be no find him, help him. No. Oh, when I recommend that. What does that mean? It means he's no alright. After that explosion, they got oil or some shit on him and just. I don't know. He freaked out. Went for me. He's still out there. You mean out here? As in out here with me? Aye. That's exactly what I mean. Oh, that's just fucking brilliant. Have you seen anyone else? I just go here. Where are you going anyway? Back to accommodation. Listen, you'll have to get through the water tanks to get up to accommodation. And quiet like. I'll go all the way up there. Jesus. And what about Gibble? Stay the fuck away from me. You're listening to me. It's no right, cuz. I'm not arguing. Cuz. Be fucking careful, eh? Aye. You know.
Ani mi. Fucking say something. The fucking thing's locked. <laughs> McCleary here. Cross, it's O'Connor. I've got Bruce and Fergus with me. You know what's going on? No, but we hit something. You need to get out of there. Don't need to tell me twice. Listen, something's wrong in engineering. It's not safe. We'll go through the leg and come up through the underrick. Rennick better give the evacuate. Connor, you have to go through accommodation. It's all blocked. Do you hear me? O'Connor! I'm going to book. Christ, that stuff is rank. Somebody back there. I need to check. Trots! Trots! Is that you? I can't hear you, man. Open the door. Trots, the door's blocked. I can't get to you. What's up, wee man? Are you hurt? Get in, quick. Thank God you're all right. 
Jesus, what are you doing in here? What do you think I'm doing in here? What the bloody hell is going on? I don't know. People are dying, Roy. Dead? Who? who who's, who's dead? How? Uh, Douglas. Trots, I think. I, I don't know. It's, it's this thing. I, I think it's doing something to people. I don't know what to believe, you know what I mean? I do, I really do. I saw something out on the deck. I, I didn't stay to look. It just scared the shit out of me. I should barricade the door. We can't hide, Roy. We have to get off this rig right the fuck now. Well, without Rennick say so. Roy, did you hear Rennick? But you think we're getting evacuated? He'd want everybody back at work if we were at the bottom of the North fucking sea. <sighs> right. The lifeboats, then? Aye. You stay. Barricade the door. Let me clear a path, and once we're ready to go, I'll come and get you, right? I'll be here, don't worry. Getting some extra prayers in. <laughs> <laughs> we're going to need them. Gosh, um... You won't leave me. It's bloody terrifying out there. I'm not leaving you, Pat. I wouldn't blame you if you did, mate. I mean, you've got all the food in here for a start. <laughs> Listen, get your man upstairs on the case, and I'll see you soon, right? Dangerous out there. No, locked. 